ho. <laughs> oh my gosh, we got our Christmas music on in the office and we're just jamming away, everybody. Anyway, high energy day today. So I hope you're having a super high energy day too. Um, we do have a lot of people coughing though. For sure we were just <laughs> there's michelle out there coughing we're keeping her away right now but anyway um i hope you really are having a super blessed day and um we are kind of having a kind of a special show so it a little bit different right the vault so if you're not familiar how we do these shows um you literally go to our website sarda.com you're gonna go to the sarda socials and specials page and on this one, we are calling it the Rainbow Vault. So that's the one you want to click on. And we've made it really nice because there's no pictures. Because there's literally limited items. Um, now, we already showed this. So this is literally last chance um, to, to see these items and purchase these items. Um, but what we will have on there is basically... Um, we took our, our price. It's it's about sixty percent off. So, um, really amazing values. Um, we have gemstone. We have small silver, but we will be touring them. So, ladies, right here, if you're not, you're like, I don't see anything yet. It's because this is kind of how we start, okay? And I'm gonna have multiple pieces, okay, um, in the collection. So. What we do is like, this is the very first one. So this is our Bully Sunrise. And there's two pieces in this collection. There's a pair of earrings and a bracelet. So when you go, Sarah's actually gonna read off the style number right away. When I come in, she's gonna say just the style numbers. And then we'll go into size and fit and such. And then of course, I will model them for you on also, okay? So um, we'll kind of go slow here at the, the beginning, but we only have one size in the bracelet, right, Sarah? Yep, so this is bracelet 6107. This is a seven and a half inch bracelet fitting a 675 to a seven and three quarters interest. And then the accompanying earrings are J6109. Okay, so you see, this is that really beautiful Janelle Adair. It's a princess cut. Uh, topaz, which is our exclusive Bali sunrise. Okay, so pretty. You get pinks, you get oranges, you get peaches, and of course, almost like that rainbow of colors when it's cut properly. You, you you pick up a little bit of blues and yellows, and a little bit of green even in this. Okay, so this is a seven and a half. Um, she gave you the fit. So I just so you know, I'm a uh, six. Uh, inch wrist here, six and a quarter inch wrist here. Okay, so of course this is not my size, but this gives you an idea what that's going to look like on. Okay, so what we will have with this also though is a pair of the earrings. So um, I'll show you that little stone number here. And again, that's earring six one zero nine. Okay, and um, you will see that hopefully in your lineup that there's literally. Um, that's the second item, uh, or maybe this was first, but um, that's how you'll be able to shop. Now, we don't have multiple pieces on these items. The gemstone, whatever you're seeing, we have one piece, okay? The silver, when we first showed them, we might have had two uh, or more. Um, so, everything's very, very limited. But these are designs that I designed over the last 10 years. And we do have um, the different um, pieces. So you might have already seen this collection from me um, in the past and this gives you um, an ability to be able to maybe fill in um, on a few of the items that uh, you missed out on maybe you already have the bracelet and you were looking for the earrings or such to go with it okay okay so those are our first two items so the next items we're going to do is the pink opal yep and this is bracelet five eight one two the matching pendant is 5813, and the matching earrings are 5815. Okay, gorgeous, gorgeous. It's that really beautiful pastel. Um, the pink opal is natural and undyed, okay? So, um, gorgeous material um, in the pink opal. And as you can see, I love the design of this bracelet because it's shaped like my cushion rectangle bracelets. And look at those, these are custom cut, like these are made to order. Fancy pyramids um, done in a cab 
but just that really perfect pop of pink. Um, if you have any of your, um, the pink, you know, quartzes that I do, gorgeous. Or even the English or the British tea roses in some of the topazes I do. Um, but again, really cool stuff. This one is not my size. Who does this fit? This is a seven and a quarter fitting a six and three quarters to seven and a quarter inch wrist. Okay. But you get to see just a beautiful, beautiful um, bracelet on. Okay, so I will go to the pendant next because we this one is a three-piece ensemble that we have, but only one piece. You will actually be receiving the one we're showing. And this is pendant 5813. And you see how big that stone is? Like, that is amazing. And I just love the shape of it. And you see how pink opals kind of, you can see almost that really beautiful flow of color. Um, and I would call the opal more of an um, opaque stone. So it's you're not going to have that translucence to it. It's just that really beautiful uh, color. Almost like that perfect nail polish everybody looks for. Okay, I do have the earrings. You can see that as for the set. Oh, let me get a little measure on that pendant for you just so you can get an idea because it's a medallion. It is definitely has some uh, size to it. Look, at it's three inches for the pendant. And then I will pull that earring up for you. And you can see I did it in the watermark with the high polish and the hammered. And this is earring 5815. And we have these priced at $129. Such a great deal for Opal. Just really elegant. I mean, like so, you know, right there, that kind of set with, especially in winter right now, because I wear a lot of heather gray charcoals, like those kind of colors are so pretty. Yeah. It just, to me, it looks like a really pretty pink cashmere. Okay, so those are the three items. We'll move on to some all silver. Oh my gosh. So what do we got here? We have got the Watermark Path of Life set. So this is bracelet 5770. We've got matching pendant 5771. Matching ring 5772. Okay. You know what? I wanted to go grab that really cool wrap um, ring that we've got in the leaves. Because, oh my gosh, this would be so beautiful. I'd love that ring as a thumb ring or even as an ensemble for the, the other one. But this is that really difficult um, way, this structure, not a lot of people, not a lot of uh, manufacturers or designers really do this because it's quite difficult. It's all handmade chain, um, but to manipulate that just perfectly. But look at the beautiful leaves in the end caps. Um, you've got your swivel lobster that makes it really easy to get on. Of course, my kiss to you is my gallery. I love that uh, for you, but lots of adjustability. So this is going to fit a lot of people. Yep, this fits from a six and three quarters to an eight inch wrist. Perfect. I'm going to get it on that last one, or maybe I'll just do it on the second one. Okay, but see how pretty that is? And so really, it's going to accommodate a lot of different sizes there. Okay, I will go to the ring next because I love the side uh, shank and profile on this. And this is ring 5772. Okay. So pretty. And um, in the ring, we have a size 8. So there you go. A little bit of a different shape, but kind of capturing that kind of shape in the ring. Um, and then we have the pendant. And this is pendant uh, 5771. Okay, so pretty. But do you see how this was like made and then the leaves were literally layered over the top of that? I love that. And this was always my favorite bill too because I always put a fringe of panty like on the top. So as you're wearing it, you look down, you get a flower every, all day. So fun. Okay, very, very sophisticated set right there. Okay, we have one of each, only an eight, one pendant, and one bracelet. The babes are oohing and aahing over your new nails today. Oh, I, I didn't change my nails yet, but maybe a little bit of the grunt, yes. <laughs> um, I love mixing up my nails. It's always fun to go in. I go in early to pick my colors. Nice. Like. Yeah, I design my nails too. It takes me forever to pick out my nail color. <laughs> and this is the Trust Him in Everything set. We've got bracelet 6230, pendant 6231, and earring 6233. 
And this has that full adjustability on it again. So this is, you know, I love the bracelets like that because really they're gonna fit so many people. And I love it in a stack because if you have like one of the bangle bracelets, I think it's always really pretty to have something, one of the link bracelets with it. And this will fit from a six and a half to an eight inch wrist. Okay. So we're gonna have that. Um, I'll go straight to the pendant next. This is pendant 6231. Okay. And um, this has the little flat jaw one with the hammered, and this has the magnet enhancer on it. And I'll give it a little bit of a measure so we can see. Again, I love my, like, a little bit more of a statement piece. Um, I'll put the earrings by it so you can see the scale and the size. It's, it's um, perfectly done together if you're a set girl. And this is earring 6233. Okay. Lightweight, not heavy either, ladies, um, on the earrings. There we go. Okay, well, that is a three-piece set right there. Oh, I've got to get something for this. This is driving me crazy. Um, I'm going to try to get something to where you don't hear that. Ooh, I can't believe people use this in their bathroom. Is this like a tile? I don't think oh, I could yeah. do that. That would be awful. I'd scare myself every day. <laughs> Okay, we're moving on to an all silver bracelet. I love it. It's like one of the really beautiful um, watermark and flat jaw. Actually, that's the flat jaw one, isn't it? This is the Overflowing Abundance bracelet. This is bracelet number 4257. It's an oval 675-inch bracelet. Look at the T. T Victoria. Teresa Jory. Like, let's name all the volume names with T's. <laughs> okay, well, this one... Um, Oh, who does this fit? This is 675. This 675 six seven seven? is going to fit, yeah, um, it's going to fit a 6.5 to a 675. Okay. See, I'm thinking like, see, this is where I like to, you know, kind of like mix it up together to work. Because basically the person that wears that could do that together, right? Oh, yeah. That'd be good. Okay. So that is a standalone piece. Um, I will bring the next, uh, actually we have three bracelets in a row. So this is kind of cool. This will be... Uh, somebody, a uh, seven and a half. Oh, this will be good. Yep, this is bracelet 5734. Um, it's a hammered hinge cuff bracelet in a size seven and a half. So that will fit from a seven to an eight inch wrist. Oh, I love this bracelet. Yeah, the, the quality of this one, this is fabulous. Okay. And of course, not my size, but very cool. Okay. Um, we'll go straight into the next bracelet. We only have one of these, one of these, and one of these. They're one of the kinds. This is bracelet 4722. This is a size 675, fitting from a 6 to a 6 and 3 quarters inch wrist. Okay, this is that overlap bracelet that I did, but I love that it has the basket weave. I did a bunch of things um, in the past. It has the uh, high polish hammered on that. The Janelle Adair Gallery. You can see beautiful gallery. Um, I remember this was earlier on that I designed this one, and it's the quality is just beyond. I love the way this one opens in the overlap area. Isn't that cool? That's so cool. Yeah, the feature of that, the, the quality. But again, my bracelets are made to stack. You might start with one, but eventually you'll get another one, and you'll, you'll be a stacker on that too. Okay, let's go to the next one. The next one is the All Your Promises bracelet, and that's bracelet 664, I'm sorry, 4464. Um, and then we also have the coordinating pendant, that's pendant 4465. Okay, oh, this one also has the little pendant yep. too. And this seven inch bracelet will fit a six and a half inch wrist with about a half an inch gap. Oh, I love this, look, I love the shape of this piece. Um, ooh, I kind of like it with this one, too, actually. I know, it matches so many of your pieces. I know, I'm like, ooh, both looks good. Okay, and there we go. Okay, that's somebody. <laughs> okay, so that gives us the, the three bracelets there. Um, I, I was, yeah, I always start the shows kind of like with nothing on, so I, I felt like I really needed that little hug of the silver. Okay, oh, let's go into some earrings. And um, this is kind of a series of things that I did. Um, it looks like this um, the, the full set sold out, but we do have the earrings. And 
Again, this is when I was doing a lot of the flat jaw one. Those were the round beads. It looks very much like my watermark, um, but I called it scattered jaw one because I, I just had fun placing in the little flat beads um, and filling in different spaces. So yeah, these are very, very cute. And this is earring 4273, the faithful servant earring, and we've got these priced at $49.99. Oh, wow. Yeah, very, very cute. Even the small pieces like this, I still put in a really great little beautiful gallery too. Yes, we like to do a bunch of little hand detail. Oh, now, okay, this is the one, um, it looks like we only have the earrings to this too, but this is the uh, pendant that I wear all the time on my satellite chain. This is one of the ones that I layer in all the time. Um, I, I, I don't know, it's like, it's like my protection. It's put on your shield of faith. And uh, for me, I, I feel like I can conquer the day. Like, it's that. like my shield. God, I'm putting my shield on today. Let's go. Protect me. These are the what a, whatever is noble earring. And this is earring number 6141. And we've got these priced at $69.99. Okay. There you go. And, you know, another common design I do, you know, I use the beads and the different pieces. But, of course, fully finished gallery, too. Okay, so that is tray one. So we have, I don't know how much time you ladies have to hang out, but we have, um, ten oh, 10 trays. Ten trays. Okay, so 10 trays. Okay, look at this. We sold the collection, but we still have the white mauve ring. Okay, so we've got one ring left. And this is ring 5974. If you're an eight, you're super lucky. And it's so pretty. Yeah, the roses are like, we love our roses, but really pretty. I love the scalloping, but that's also has to be bezel set too. But look at great luminosity. This is why I'm so sad that I can't get the pearls from Bali anymore, but um, I'm kind of excited that we're able to bring these back um, as vault items, like literally one of a kind of items. You're literally getting to see a couple decades of designs that I've been doing. So, um, in really, really limited things. We might at probably about 5% reorder some of these two ladies. So, um, we're expecting to hear from you what you would like to see us reorder for you. Um, but this one is um, beautiful. Is this a uh, blue sea? Uh, this is the Serenity. Serenity. The sea Serenity. Yep. And this is bracelet 6156. This is a six and three quarters bracelet fitting from 575 to uh, 675 interest. And then coordinating Tanzanite. pendant is 6154. This looks a lot like tanzanite. Like you get that tanzanite pops of color that's in it. Yeah. Very much so. A little pretty, bit of pretty, blue, pretty. a little bit of purple. Looks like somebody picked up on the ring, um, but we've got the, the pendant and the bracelet. Beautiful. Look at all that scalloping like on the edge. The ring is like one of my favorites. Like it's that big, bold statement piece. Okay, I'm gonna move on to another standalone piece. And this is the Ardent. So you know I run a ton of things online right now. Oh my gosh, matter of fact, we have that. Uh, this is a princess cut too, and we have the princess cut ring right now. Um, but again, I love the pyramids. I, you know, this was something that you saw in a lot of fashion. So kind of brought it into my traditional Janelle Adair. I like the size of this one too. This is bracelet 5280. It's an oval seven inch bracelet fitting from a six to a seven inch wrist. Yeah, and I wear a seven. So um, I like to wear six and a half, six, seven, five, sevens. Um, yeah, this, I would stack my other sevens with it. Beautiful. Okay. So what else? Do, oh, looks like we have a tanzanite I'm ring. I'm surprised if there's tanzanite ah, left. Especially in this one because it's such a gorgeous uh, design. Like, so beautiful. So, like, almost could have come from the Victorian era. And this is ring 5983. Yes, it definitely gives me like regal vibes. Yeah, it's like, okay, there you go. And $119 and size for Tanzanite. Mm. Oh, that's great. <laughs> that's a good great. Ooh, ooh, and durable. <laughs> Tanzanite. Oh, wait, wait, we didn't have earrings. I'm so sorry. Okay, so we do have a pair of earrings though. So let me put that back out here because we do have the Tanzanite earrings. And this is earring 5984. 
And these little French wire earrings are $159.99. There you go. Yeah, these are not heavy either. Like, it's a nice weight to these too. Okay, let's go into the next one is our little pearl. I've done this in moissanite. I've done it in silver. This is one of my little styles that, like, it's kind of classic Sarda, okay? And um, this is... Uh, this is ring 5851. And we've got coordinating earring 5852. I love the filigree. I love that even, even on a small piece like this, I still have that gorgeous gallery. Delicate, elegant still. I love how it, it's almost like a bypass, but with the butterfly style. Okay, and then the gorgeous earrings. And I always am so amazed. I love how detailed my artisans got. For as small of a piece as this is, look at the little three flower cluster and the two if, two butterflies on this le cute little stud. Wow, so much detail. So cute. Yeah, I have these in moissanite and pearl. I mean, two classic, classic stones, right? Yep. Okay. Oh, did I give you the style number on the earrings? The earring uh, is 5852. Go okay. Oh my gosh, the cornflower blue opal. Okay, so I did have a bracelet. It looks like that's gone. Um, this one really you get really a rainbow prism of colors. So even though it says the cornflower blue, you really are getting a multi multi like an opal. Okay, so this pretty much you could coordinate with any kind of gemstone. And this is ring five seven eight five. We've got a price at $119.99. I love the bezels on these too. But yep, fit like, fits like a glove, just like how I always call it my snuggy hug fit because I just, it's like I'm wrapping my little arms around and just, there you go, really pretty. Ooh, you know what? That would be really pretty. I have the, that floral that I did and it was almost like a sunflower kind of, um, boy, that would be really pretty. That all silver collection with that. If you oh, yeah. have that bar style bracelet I did with the little beads on, man, this would be a really pretty ring to put with that collection if you have it. Oh my gosh, I can't believe we have these left. <gasps> okay, so this is a standalone. The other piece is, um, this is uh, an earring with the roses, but these are two hand-carved angel wings with, look at the little dragonflies that overlap. Look at that. This is earring 5291, priced at $149.99. And they did a left and right, which is absolutely insane. These are all hand-carved. Look at, look at the detail on them. The wow. talent it takes to be able to do that. It's oh my just gosh. Well, and also too, they had to, it, a little bit of a learning curve because they usually carve on the bone. And I was like, ooh, my ladies aren't gonna, not going to want bone. Oh, yeah. So we had, I was you like, no, no, no. <laughs> so anyway, I brought the shell and man, they're just, they're, they're so talented. Like Bali, that's, I mean, when I got there, it was just like, yeah, I went all over the island painting and doing wood carving. And I mean, I, mean, I was just cards. at home. I loved it. This is uh, earring 5777. This is black spinel. Mm. And it's a fancy cut. I don't like you ladies to have regular. So everything is like, just like my jewelry, I draw my jewelry designs out. I do the same thing with the gemstones. So I come up with different facets and cuts because I really want you to have unique, um, really custom jewelry. Um, that's not going to be anywhere but for me. So um, I'm always very confident knowing it's like, no, somebody's not going to look like this because literally they're every aspect from the stones to the silver um, is in my head. So I'd like to make things a little bit more um, special special, and not um, really do too much of anything. I move on to a new mm -hmm. style. That way you, you do have that exclusivity. Okay. These are cute as a button. It's like a little button. These are really cute. This is earring 6128. These are uh, freshwater pearls. See, oh my gosh, I really love these. Actually, this why, why didn't I keep these? We need these. But like the butterfly maybe is too much frangipani. Like to me, classic. And then a really, like I like this I mean, combination. Mm -hmm. That's probably how I wear that. But look, actually I better give a measure because I kind of feel like this is that 
perfect petite thing. Yeah, I love this stud. Um, I might have to do some bracelets and stuff. It's very contemporary. Okay, um, let's see. Let's, ooh, I'm gonna put both of these in together because look at with the pink, the salmon pink to see where it pulls that pink out. Oh my gosh, I kinda like those together. Okay, so this is the British Tea Rose. So this is the quartz. Sure is. This is bracelet 6198. It is a 7 to 8 inch uh, bracelet fitting a 6 to 8 inch wrist. Love it. Okay. And I love my toggles. I love the fit of them. So um, Sarah gave you that range that it's going to fit you. Okay. These you want to make sure that you stay within that range because these are all designed and engineered that way. Okay. Beautiful. Okay, so there's that. Oh, I kind of feel like pink and then hearts. Um, this was part of the key collection that I did. And speaking of, I've got another key collection that's going to be coming up uh, probably in about a month. This is the Proof of His Love earring. Uh, this is earring 5886. And then that opal ring is ring 6306. These are super lightweight, ladies. Sometimes key earrings can, like, sometimes they can get kind of on the heavy side. These are very, very lightweight. But you still get that drama, the length. Mm -hmm. I like that. Okay, so this is my spin on the classic woven, hand-woven uh, cable that I did. Somebody had suggested just a tip to tip. You know the other style I have, it has two beads here with that one. So this is still that really flexible kind of like bracelet that you can actually flex in, but very, very pretty. Um, just a great like stacking kind of bracelet. And this is bracelet uh, 3558. It's a six and a half inch fitting a six to seven inch wrist. Six, seven, five. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, it's six, seven, six, seven five. five and it fits what? A six to a seven inch wrist. I'd say six to seven and a quarter because these are flexy. Yeah, so if you're seven and a quarter, 100%, this is going to work for you too. Yeah. But we always go on the shy side for you, just in case. Okay, this was a series. Um, oh, I forgot to show the ring. How did I miss that? Sorry about that. Okay, you're, they're like, Janelle, what about the salmon pink ring? Yeah, because you can see the pink and, of course, those gorgeous uh, yellows and oranges. I love how the pink is underlined and you get those other colors. Mm -hmm. This is ring 6306. Okay. I like the little flat jaw and beads too on that. Really pretty on that. Oh, that's a good size. True size eight? Yeah. I, we need this ring again. Okay. So let me get that out of here. And I will bring, there's a pendant. So this is kind of my spin on bringing that infinity, that past, present, future, that father, son, holy ghost. Like I, I love doing the infinity in, in threes like that. Um, but this was my little bracelet for somebody who's a very petite wrist, this works. But this is how I got you another extension. So if you need another extension for your necklaces or this is a separate piece, basically, that I was able to kind of design in with my artisans. Get you a cute little bracelet. See how cute this is right here? And this is bracelet 4023, fitting from a five and a half to an eight and a half inch wrist. See, so see how you could wear that just as a regular bracelet like this, you know, if you have a smaller wrist like that. And then you would have that extra extender that you could actually bring into a necklace. Um, because everything's really big right now with necklaces showing this. So you could do your regular chain and wear that towards the front. And that would kind of be your little matching piece for this bracelet. Isn't that cute? Or ladies, if you need that size, you just keep it right. And it fits more people, right? So this will fit. This has a huge size and fit range that this will fit up to. See, love that. Lots of versatility. And then we have the little pendant. And this is pendant 4024. This is the protector of the faith set. That protection. Okay. 
He's the vine, we're the branches, we stay in him. Well, like we always have that, right? Okay, these are so cute. Those, actually I love the, just the animals. The little studs are so cute. Okay, oh, it's probably the bracelet we're starting with. Okay. We've got bracelet 6244. This is the thanks in all circumstances set. Ooh, this is a sturdy bracelet. Wow, this has got some uh, girth to it. Like, wow, ladies, this is a really nice, yeah, this is this is that definite forever quality. And this seven and a half inch bracelet will fit from a six and three quarters to seven and a half inch wrist. Yeah, look at that. Not my size, but wow, gorgeous. I love the watermark detail down here too. And then look how cute, these are just like that perfect little size. Look at these. This is earring six, two, four, seven. <clears throat> and of course you have the fully finished that galleries to those too. Very cute. Okay. Okay, this one, yay! We have two sizes. Now, um, there's always the battle between chain link and watermark, right? So I actually carry on our website the chain link version of this. But this gives you that really beautiful contemporary hammered with the watermark edge and two sizes. And it's a retention with a magnet, which is that busy girl bracelet I love to design for you. And this is bracelet 6752. We've got a six and a half fitting of five and three quarters to six and three quarters interest. And then we've got a seven and a half, which will fit a that. six and three quarters and seven and three quarters interest. Yeah, this, look at the style of this bracelet with that like beautiful shaping of that knife. Yeah, this is a standalone bracelet. Like, wow, love the shape of this. See how it kind of comes up? The shape of that. Mm. That's a bracelet. How much is this one? This one we've got on special for $179.99. Oh my gosh, yeah, these are the ones. Yeah, these are go for a lot more than that. That's amazing. And the size, we have a seven and a half also. I feel like that's a bigger one. It says seven and a half, huh? Yep, okay. seven and a half. Wow, that's a lot of silver. And actually, uh, Barbara Fred Hart requested <coughs> we reshow these little um, the keys. keys. Yep. Okay, the little keys, Barbara. So cute. So here's that. So. I'm thinking, I don't think that's five grams maybe total. Yeah, yeah. They're, they're very nice, the, the weight of them. I really like these next things. Yes, you ladies, let us know if there's anything else you need to see. Mm. Oh my gosh, nope, stay in order to know. That little two piece set, I love that one, okay. <laughs> Okay, so this is the really cool um, rectangle. And um, this is bracelet 4015. This square eight inch bracelet will fit from a seven <gasps> to an eight and a quarter inch wrist. These are eights. Oh my gosh, we've got eights. Um, okay, you get just the one, but oh my gosh, how cute as a, you ladies that are in the eights, oh my gosh, these would be those beautiful little framing pieces if you've oh, got yeah. a really Pretty like great, oh my gosh, right? Gemstone pieces. To me, that's, yeah. I, but look at the, even the two together are just fabulous. How much are these? 99.99. Oh my gosh, get two. Yeah. Oh my gosh, yeah. That, that one, I think that's what I did kind of think pricing too. I'm like, you kind of need two of those. Kind of need two. Okay. So um, let's, I'm gonna go into two pairs of earrings now. Um, that was the lace-up collection that I did. So I did these really fun little lace-ups, but you know what, I gotta be honest. I know you're seeing a football. Wouldn't you, like right now, everybody's leaving the office like at 4.30 because they wanna go watch the game. I'm thinking they should be wearing these earrings they today. Should. Okay, because you should always wanna look fashionable oh, yeah. at football gathering. This is earring 2039. You know, okay. if I'm going to wear something for football though, I'm going to wear it in the colors and not necessarily the shape. So give me something blue or green. <laughs> so you're wearing the jersey. You got to have luxury jewelry on too. Yeah. 
Okay, here we go. Um, this is one of my favorites. I love seeing it. Um, when I read this passage in the Bible, like I just went, oh my gosh. Like my whole lifetime, I wanted somebody to see this, but you know what? Literally feeling it. Mm -hmm. Chosen, holy, and dearly loved. That's what he tells us. Mm -hmm. yep. I love that. And this is earring 3946, and we've got those priced at $49.99. Oh, yeah. And um, the, all the, the collection uh, sold out. We just have the, the earrings left, but what a beautiful gift, right? Yes. To yourself. Yeah, <laughs> I'm thinking to, to yourself. Um, okay. Oh. Okay, you know, I, I do design sets, but um, love the open space. Um, this is a great little bracelet. This is bracelet 5262. It's an oval seven inch fitting a six to seven and a quarter inch wrist. This was on my, like, when I was doing the flat jaw one, the scattered jaw one, but just wanting something that was just really pretty and classic. Love that. And then look at the little ring that goes. This is ring 5263. Full eternity, too. Very pretty. Okay. Um, next, we have the bracelet sets. So these are the ones that you actually get two pieces with, okay? So um, these are the ones full finished gallery of watermark that then goes into the high polish hammered. These are your round bangles, okay? So these will fit a little bit different than your ovals. So, Sarah, what's this, who's this gonna fit? Yep, so this is bracelet 4453. We've got a round seven fitting a five and a half to a six and a half inch wrist, and a round seven and a half fitting a six to a seven inch wrist. Okay, so like with the sevens, I love because I would undo the, the latch with the press button and put them over. But I do love seven and a halves because these are the ones I like to travel when I wear my round ones. And I can just slide them right over my wrist like that. And these are the ones that don't come off because they're round. They're meant to like stack together. So I wanted to give you a one up on these and give you the two pieces that you need but I'll put both on so you can kind of see the size difference too because again, if you want um, a smaller fit on your bangle, then you could go with the, the, the sevens, right? Or you could go with the seven and a halves. Monica Jackson says she loves these and um, always wears them framing something. Oh, see, she takes this one and then this one, but see the size difference, you know, in the rounds? See, so you see the difference where this one I can slide right over, but I wanted to put that function onto it so you could actually have a more fitted round bangle if you wanted. Okay, but yes, Monica, these are great, aren't they? Cause like when I do a round stack, like you just keep adding, you add, you add. Oh, this is a perfect example. This is bracelet 4453. I'm going to go out of, I'm going to go out of sequence because this is the Bali Breeze bracelet but this is where you take that stack. This is the round bracelet. Um, see, I'm gonna take this one off because what size this, I think that one's a seven and a half, isn't the it? The Bali Breeze is an eight and that is bracelet two, three, one, three. Okay, so I would put this one here and then do this one. See, so snap it on there. Oops, can't see. Yep, it's right there. There we go. But see, that's, this is a round also. So there you go, you got your round stack. How cool is that? Oh yeah, that's perfect. Love it. And with me, it's great because I can slide all of them off. But anyway, that's several down, ladies, just so you know. That's the one that has the cable with the four gemstones of the topaz. And that is a round eight inch fitting a six and a half to a seven inch wrist. And I love this Ruby Irwin. Two is good, three is better. I know, Just right? Idea. Especially in a round. Okay, I skipped ahead. I'm sorry. I'll go back in order now. So now you'll be able to see this one. This is earring 4244. Okay. And look at thin, sleek, so you're not getting too much weight, but you still get that, that great look from the side, right? Yeah. Love this. Yeah, about an inch and a quarter. 
Yeah, not too heavy too. Always, there, you can never have enough designs in a hoop, you know? It, because they're always appropriate. It's always a staple, yeah. Okay, so let's do the Mother of Pearl Hearts next. And this is a ring 6131 and pendant 6130. So this is the Mother of Pearl with the fringe of panties, that really beautiful floral. And this has the magnet enhancer. And then we also have the ring. And that is ring 6131. Okay. And now, is that hammered all the way around? Eternity. Perfect. Pretty fascinating. Okay, so now we've got a little bit of blue con. Now we're going to go into just a few one-off items. Um, there's a really beautiful blue zircon uh, ring on our site right now. That's like the tanzanite one. Oh, that would go perfect. Oh with my that. gosh, I would love that with that. Yeah. This is bracelet 6177. This is a six and three quarters fitting a six to an eight inch wrist. So lots of adjustability. Yep. So, yep, this is going to fit a lot of people. So I'm a six. So, of course, it can start with me. And, and then, of course, you've got all those other sizes that you could do. Okay, true Picasso time. We got a necklace. So it looks like everything's, um, I have a bunch of stuff on site that's gonna go with this. So um, ladies, look on the site because everything is 40% off right now. So I have a bunch of things that will match with this, okay? This is necklace 9,000. It's a 20 inch necklace. And yeah. how many inches of extension does 20 it? 20 inches and then four inches of extenders. So this will be that gorgeous matinee length. Um, that you can wear. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, another bracelet. This is bracelet 4124. This is a seven and a half. Um, it's an oval bracelet fitting a six and three quarters to seven and a half interest. And this is the one that I actually did as a series. I had the kyanite that I designed with it too because I love the all silver next to that. I did one with a stone in it. It was kind of like... I introduced it not together, but in a series because to me, that's how I would buy things. Okay, kitty, kitty, kitty. I was just out. We've got the office kitty. Um, and I love it. Beth came over during the holidays and was feeding it every oh, day. But we, we are definitely fur baby mamas here. And we, I love designing cat jewelry. Um, and is this beautiful? I mean, it's like, this is a gorgeous little necklace. This is a necklace 9002, and that is teal quartzite in there. Yeah. And this is an 18 inch necklace with four inches of extension. That's a great necklace. Okay, love that. Okay, so that's a one off piece too, and we will go into the next collection because um, the Indonesian coral, I am going to be having a lot of the blue, the navy blue coming in. Um, because I just, I love the color. I love the blue. So this is um, just a one-of-a-kind piece right now. This is bracelet 1915. This is a six and a half inch bracelet fitting from a five to a seven and a quarter inch wrist. Okay, so I probably, as a six inch wrist, I probably put it on the second toggle right there. Um, so yeah, love that. Yeah, interesting because I don't do a lot of bracelets that are this length. This is actually a really good length, actually. I really like that. So even if I wanted to wear it on that last one, let me see what that looks like. I could do that if I wanted it a little bit looser, too. You sure could. Beautiful. Okay, cool. Okay, oh wow, coral, coral to volcanic stone. Okay, so we have one piece, wow, the amount of silver that's in this one. Okay, so look at the inside gallery. Oh my gosh, just a beautiful piece. So you got your safety eight right here, okay? So you just lift that open, and then you have that retention um, on this bracelet there. And this is Gorgeous. bracelet 5296. This is a seven and three quarters, fitting from a seven wow. to an eight inch wrist. That's beautiful. That is a bracelet. Wow. 
Yeah, that's nice. We're, we're struggling to try to get all the, this is all has to be perfectly inlaid into this. Like we have the red pearl right now. <gasps> okay. This was the bracelet that gave back. Okay. So we went up, we got the vol. This is the volcanic stone from Bali. Okay. Then we used the coral and then we used our little, uh, beads, our sterling silver chain link beads. But look at this, look how cool this little clasp is. So you just press that in, see that little button there? And that's how you close it. And then you just press it again to open it. But um, such a cool little bracelet. Let me put that on. Let's see, and this is bracelet 4491. We've got this available in two sizes. So oh, that's one that you like you have you press the ring. Oh, press it. But see, I was able to do that myself. So she had it. If you just latch it in, but you want to press and then put that in, and it creates that little bead for you. Isn't that cool? So I'm a six inch wrist, so this would probably be a six inch and down, I'd say, that this fits. Yeah, so the seven and a quarter fits a five and a half to uh we actually have six and a half on here, so we'll get that updated to No, I don't smaller. think I would do I like to me I'd want it like a little bit looser. Okay. Yeah. And then for the eight inch we've got that from six and a half to seven and a quarter. Oh my gosh, I have the emerald bracelet left, but this one is smaller than the size eight that I showed you. So this is a true size seven. Yep, this four is Sakota emeralds in it. Wow. Bracelet 4412 fitting from a five to a six and a half inch wrist. Wow, those are four I, I can't use the Sakota Emerald anymore. It's too expensive. Uh, it's too Especially expensive. not getting any like see? Like, yeah, these were so hard to do in the first place. It was one of those impossible tasks, but beautiful, beautiful. Amberly was asking me about these before because she's like, I needed to get some for my set. Because um, I had those in a, I, I kind of did them more in the precious gemstones. So yes, love, love, love. Um, and then it's got the beautiful tree of life, but I love the cable that's with it too. But this is a round bracelet. With and your, this bangle will fit from a five to a six and a half interest. Yep. Sounds good. Okay, on to the next, okay, which is a necklace, okay? This is the very spinel. No, it's black spinel. spinel. Okay, I looking at the shape, I almost thought it was my very, oh, just a, like, this is your, like, everyday necklace. Like, this is your, this is what I call your hero pieces. 18 inches, but four inches of extenders. This is that one that you're like, no, nah, I don't need any other pendants because I wear my necklace every day mm -hmm. and it goes with everything. This is necklace 4530. Yeah, these are great. And these are those, uh, the barrel beads. I love those little barrels. So pretty. Okay. Oh my gosh, it looks like we've got the tip to tip though to go with it. So um, that was in a series. Oh, we have two sizes. Yep, we've got two <gasps> sizes. This Lovely. is bracelet 4531. We've got it in a six and three quarters fitting from a six to a seven interest and a seven and a half fitting a six and three quarters to seven and three quarters interest. Love it. Yeah, these are your, like, these That's are your- That's definitely a hero. I mean, your go-to bit, right? I mean, it's like, what would you not put the black spinel with, right? That is a great set right there. Okay. Always, we, I know we don't have enough black spinel on our site. I know. I feel like everybody's going, Janelle, when are you bringing more black spinel? I'm working on it. <laughs> I don't really am. This is bracelet 4551. Five, this is a blue topaz bracelet, a seven and a half, fitting a six and three quarters to seven and a half inch wrist. Still most expensive cut you can actually do is a briolette, especially when you go into topazes like this, especially this color. Gorgeous. Okay, but they're getting a steal at $169.99 for this bracelet. Yeah, these are irreplaceable now. Could never do those again at that cost. Um, okay, so blue topaz, I'm like, it's gonna, it's, yeah. She's I feel like we're gonna be out of it for a couple of years. I know. Um, when I go to Tucson, I'm gonna be having some talks with my vendors going, come on. I know you're sitting in vaults like I have, yeah. that you're sitting Maybe on this stone that I know you can do better. Like, right? Okay. Yep, yeah, we, we were digging to their vault. I'll come, right. I'll come over there and I'll get in your vaults for you. This is earring 3904. I love that these are like full, full. Like, yeah. This is a very, very beautiful, well-made earring for sure. 
And then coordinating earring 3903. I'm sorry, coordinating ring yes. 3903. This is like a princess ring. Like this is like, I, I was I was like, I want to make like a tiara style ring, you know? Maxine and her tiara. Understated crown. Right, yeah. You know, and I just think they're really pretty on too. Something like that on, on a finger too. Very wearable, pretty. Great little set. Okay, whoops, that's over here. Oh, speaking of the flat jawline, we had a lot of flat jawline. Yep, this was my, my era of doing a lot of flat jawline. There is all your hand inlaid granulation work there. This is Love the this part illustrious too. pendant, pendant 3997. Ooh, so sorry, ugh, okay. Whether I get a sweater or something, I cannot do another show without this. Okay. Let's see. Oh, and these are the bangles. Um, so we've got two sizes in this guy. This is a uh, two set bangle. Five, two, nine, two. We've got a round seven and three quarters fitting from a five and a half to six and a quarter. And a round eight fitting from a seven to an eight. Yeah, these are those. I love that we had a bunch of round bangles. Like these could all kind of go together. You know, yeah. like in stack up. If you're one of the lucky ladies with the perfect size, they hit all these perfect But I love bracelets. this because they're literally together. Like they're like made together like that, which is so cool. So fun. I love the wave to them also. Okay. Ooh. What was I thinking? There we go. There's, there's your round. This is your other round bracelet. And this is a bracelet 6329. This is a round eight fitting from a seven to an eight inch wrist. Yeah, see what, that's a great little stack, round on round. That's what we should have done, and we should have done that gemstone. I love that. Okay. Yeah, there are some ladies that, like, you know, I just do rounds. I love rounds. Uh, but I've been designing ovals for a long time, so it's kind of cool to bring, be able to bring all these rounds out for you because I've been doing so many ovals. Okay, we have a three-piece set, and I don't know how she is still here. Because especially since she's raising her hallelujah here, um, but this is the gorgeous pendant. And then look at the really beautiful like earrings to match. And love this bracelet. And this is the uh, Through All Troubles set. Uh, we've got necklace 5896, uh, bracelet 5897, and earring 5898. Actually, we have two sizes of this bracelet. We've got a uh, seven and three quarters and a seven. So we will fit anywhere from a six to an eight inch wrist. And the necklace is 20 with four inches of extender. So that goes to that great matinee length of 24 inches. And look how beautiful. It's, it's, just, it's just gorgeous because it kind of V's out when you wear it like this. Fully finished. And this is necklace 5896. And then those have the little watermark end caps too that go to that. But she's, she's, um, look at, look at the size of that. The span, the wingspan on it's beautiful. And then of course the little earrings to go too. Those are earring 5898. Okay. That's why I was telling everybody, don't worry. Um, well, you know, as we were showing stuff, some of these things will pop back up. Um, and we had about 50 items that never made it into our system. So I showed them, um, but they weren't shoppable. So with us making mistakes, see, you didn't even miss out. <laughs> this okay. is bangle 3310. This is an oval seven and a half fitting from a seven to a seven and three quarters interest. Okay, and this is that uh, love one another style that you can wear really fitted. Great piece. I have this right now in the chain link that I do. And I love these because you can literally turn them around and wear them as a tip to tip also though. So you can stack these with your other bracelets as a tip to tip. Oh, those will look really nice. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we, I have a three-piece set here, and um, oh, this is that bracelet that I was saying I'd love to bring back. 
um, because it's so much work doing all these little pieces. This is the Strength to the Weary set. We've got bracelet 4458. We've got ring 4459 and earring 4460. And this seven and a half inch bracelet fits from a seven to a seven and a half inch wrist. And don't let that fool you because I'm a six and a quarter inch bracelet. It, um, it's the way that we measure them. So people are sometimes like, it, they're deceived by that thinking, oh, I can't buy a seven and a half, but we have to actually measure it from there. But look at, I'm a six, six and a quarter inch wrist. And that still looks really nice. But very classic. But this kind of functioning and piece um, is very, very expensive in the industry to produce. So usually you see really, really high uh, dollars on these kind of bracelets. So I was really excited to bring um, everybody like a really style like this, but affordable finally. Yeah. Okay, cute little patootie ring. We always can never be have enough of the small little like little Goldilocks rings, right? And this is ring four four five nine, and we've got it priced at forty nine ninety nine. Mm hmm. And look at the cute little earrings. Earring four four six zero, also priced at forty nine ninety nine. Yeah. Those are cute. These are so lightweight that like you, I think I'd forget I had them on. I'd definitely be going to bed in these on accident. Okay, yeah, they look really great. Those are the ones that I sometimes will see like the baristas where it's the kind of earrings that size and going, oh, yeah. gosh, those look just really good. You know, like I laugh, like, well, and they could be a little parasitic because my favorite girls, I, I give them some sometimes too. I love that. This is bracelet 5811. This is an Ooh, oval seven and a half fitting from a six and three quarters to a seven and a half inch wrist. Love the function on this one. Oh, okay. So this is just, it's graduated. So you see how it's a little thicker and then it goes a little bit thinner. Again, this, this, the quality and the weight of this, these are those luxury bangles. Um, I, I have to tell you, you get one of these kind of from me, you'll keep coming back for more bracelets from me because like I, this is how I'd love to design them and actually craft them to where they just like they just feel and wear fabulous. Like they're fully cushioned and just soft and elegant. Okay, so only one of those anyway. Um, now... I'm going to be doing a lot more of the bamboo. So you see the bamboo style here. It's going to be a stud, okay? So it's a cute little stud. I love how this comes out uh, from your ear. Um, and then graduates down. But yeah, lots of bamboo. But yeah, these are very complicated, even though they look very simple. Very complicated to put these kind of uh, pieces together like this because every single back has to be like put on separately. So a lot of labor goes into making a cute, just simple pair of earrings this like this. Love. This is earring uh, 5868, the He's a Pain Taker. Okay, I'm gonna break out the song. It's one of my favorite songs. Okay, here we go. Lori Bush is out there singing right now. I can hear her. <laughs> Okay, this, oh my gosh, we love this. This is the double heart, but this is my favorite because I give you a little uh, pendant, okay? So you'll also, this can just, it can be a bracelet charm or you can put it on one of your pendants, okay? So this slides off the piece, okay? So when you open that, you can take it off. It's a retention magnet and yeah, just a great piece. Love this. This is bracelet five eight eight seven. It's an oval seven and a half, fitting from a seven to a seven and three quarters. Double heart. Okay, I can't. Oh well, you know why we had five of these? I'm like, I can't believe we have one left. Okay, we did have five. These are really hard uh, bracelets to craft. Um, yeah, so we have one left. This is a bracelet 2072 and matching pendant 2073. This seven inch bracelet will fit from a six to a seven inch wrist. And this is the plans to give you hope set. Mm -hmm. And this is all extra hand detail that goes in this. This is 100% comb on kind of 
uh, what she does. Uh, now, this one, remember, I was only doing one. This has two, so you actually press two of those. You see how that kind of already started to open up? And then you just pull, okay? But these are the ones that you just uh, flip over and you kind of just start that little in there and then see where see you can just kind of do that and then you have that lip right there that you can just slide it into am i in the shot there we go yep okay like that and then just press down okay before the i'm trying to use the gravity to keep it there okay there we go oh no no come on get in there There it is, there it is, there it is, there. Okay, oh. Such okay, a this, I mean. It's like a glove. Oh. Yeah, that's a beautiful bracelet. That would be a four digit bracelet out there, trust me. And look at all the granulation work, the hand detail that goes into each one of those. Love it. Um, now remember, see here and here. So all you do is just press down. And what I said before, like I give yourself space, I just pull like this. And that's how I get mine off. But I didn't want to scare you. <laughs> okay. So um, next one is going to be, oh, more bamboo. Okay, I love doing some of these in the sequence because like I went into my flat jaw one, then I started doing some bamboo stuff. And then like I always kind of create and go through different seasons. So I'm so excited that you ladies can pick up. But again, you already know all my stuff matches back and forth to each other. So like I see the bamboo around the edge and then this little bamboo knot. Um, but yeah, the, now I made these kind of style earrings really heavy. These, these are really, I love that all the earrings that are left are lightweight. Oh. Well, there was one that maybe I showed that was a little heavier, but yeah, these all look at the length of that for the, the, the weight of these are amazing. Yeah. I always looked at that kind of, Oh, we have the ring. Oh, sure geez. Do. No, no, no. I got to, I got to show this with it. Four, two, eight, five and matching ring four, two, Bamboo. eight, four. And then the band. Oh, this right here, right? This, I mean, simple, but like. This puts your outfit together, right? Like a look, right there, t-shirts and jeans. You look fabulous. Yeah. Yeah, this is understated elegance. Okay, another pair of earrings. Um, this is all my braided, you know, if you have any of my cables, these are really fun, right? These are the intertwined piece earring, earring number 6323. Yeah. I did all those chains with this bead in it too. This would be really great if you have any of those chains for me. Actually, I always said they were necklaces, but then you could use them as a chain too. They were kind of, yeah, both. Okay, how's everybody doing out there anyway? Oh, look at all my little ring fingers here. Let me take some of those off here for you. I love how you have, oops, sorry. So everybody, what are you loving so far? What's been your favorite? I love it because they're like, we're shopping. Because there's only one, you know. There's only one, so we're shopping. Okay, this one, wait till you see how, like, this this bracelet, I don't even know. Like, it, it watch, okay, so you, this is my locket system, you know that. So you push down. Do you see where it snaps in here? But you see it's on a hinge. This is all bamboo. Isn't that beautiful? This is bracelet 2372, the We Have Confidence. It's a size 7, so it'll fit from a 6 to a 7 interest. Ladies, I can't even redo this system anymore. This is one, trust me, I'm doing all this moissanite with the bamboo coming up. You need this bracelet. This was really crazy because I had like six of them mm -hmm. because I need all these for my friends. These were the ones that I was supposed to be giving my friends. So. Anyway, I'm totally excited. This is, I'm gonna point you here all day. The bamboo is just, it's just another level. Okay, we actually have um, some other items, lots of watermark things that I showed you already today that's gonna to tie back to this. This is the Harmonious Tribute Pendant 2670. Wanted to do a Celtic knot and something, do you notice it's full watermark and do you see how they all overlap each other? 
Yeah, this is pretty cool piece and then soldered. This, this was pretty cool. Pretty cool how that was made. We've got some ladies loving it, having fun, love everything. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. That's next, those are sapphires, blue sapphires. Oh my gosh. Uh, but look at the cute little angel wing ring. This is the Godly Measured Ring 3038. So cute. Yep, just really great. Okay, this, and actually this is the, the okay, see, this has the three blue sapphires. I love this. This looks like it comes definitely from a different era, doesn't it? This is pendant 4794 and ring 4795. Both at $99 for blue sapphires. Blue sapphires. Those are like not lab created. Those are like real blue sapphires. Those are amazing. And usually they're black opaque. When you get sapphires this size, they're not like you see the, like these are real, real blue. Yeah. That was a series of stuff that I was wanting to do. And by the time I got it diamond set and did all this went, Ooh. Okay, I can't we sell can't it for that. that. Um, so I'm just gonna just make up the price for it because, yeah, the cost on those ladies, trust me, it's not what it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be probably four times that I think is what. But really cool, I did it. At least I mean it's stuff that I want to do myself. Okay, this is you know what? Love this. Wow, this quality of this bracelet is amazing. Look at the clasp. Look at the bar cool barrel. Uh, love this. Bracelet four five three six. It's a seven and a quarter, fitting from a six to a seven inch wrist, and that's white mother of pearl in the owl. Oh, and it's inlaid too. So let me get that put on here. And look at it's inlaid. So all of that. That's really hard for us. Like I'd love to continue to do it. The quality, and we only had a couple artisans really mm -hmm. for the for their skill set. I can't do any inlay stuff anymore. But gorgeous pieces like I love that I was able to get some of these pieces done in the time that we knew each other though ladies very cool before we moved on to some things that would be more affordable right and reasonable to actually make okay this um oh well with those earthy tones I was like hey, I probably wear those together okay so J3595 this bracelet do you see where it hinges is that like cool or what? Look at that from the side, so cool. This is an oval six and a half inch bracelet fitting from a six to a seven inch wrist. And again, that's bracelet 3595. This is a great bracelet. Um, let's talk about the stone though. This is gray moonstone and these were all done off my drawing also. So to go back with my frangipanis and all the leaf design that I do, but real genuine moonstone. Moonstone's another one that's not dyed or anything too natural. Okay, 5997. Um, let's do a signet ring, a statement. Oh, oh, yeah, these are. This is why I brought this back in the abalone, but this is the Tahitian Mother of Pearl um, shell. This is the shell, okay? And you see the nacre, they got they went into the white here, but do you see the 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 colors? That's that's not created, that comes that way. So pretty. Nature. He was just a happy little guy in there producing a bunch of really rainbow nacre. And that is a ring five nine nine seven. And then we are moving on to ring four zero nine eight. Mabe Pearl. That yeah. This was a great set. And it, it, these were all like harvested really uh, from the waters of Bali. So it was really cool. Right now I can say they're 100% Balinese, but we're gonna be getting some great ma bays, but I can't get them from the island anymore. The waters are changing and the pearls, they don't like to be in their oysters. But oh my gosh, look at the luminosity of that. Oh my gosh, that's a beautiful pearl, mother of pearl, wow. This is pendant 3982. Wow. Okay, ooh, ooh, I have a ring. Uh, we're gonna be showing you Tuesday with this in it. Oh, I love that, but it's in a faceted. Wow, I like the rainbow. I really like these earrings. Oh, these, she loves the green opal because, well, you're, you're a gemologist. You know like how unusual and how rare this material is from Australia. So, very pretty. 
Very, Very special. Pretty. This is earring 9003. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, there we go. Those are beautiful. Okay, this was my original stack set that I did. Okay, so you're getting one of the first pieces before we went into making. So you got your gorgeous peridot. You have your flat jawline ring. You have your nine by seven am Brazilian amethyst. Look at that color. Um, you have your flat jawline and you have your Swiss blue topaz. So one set in a size eight, but I'd say split them up and gift them. Gift them because these are like the stones alone for that and is crazy. One hundred and nineteen dollars. Yeah. you could get one, get one. I'll do both. I have a request from Amberly to try that on. Okay, Amberly. Oh, this is the eight, the Amberly. Blue. I know she wanted you to try it on. It's the this. eight. It's too big for you, Amberly. I'm sorry. That's the eight. You could do a seven and a half, Amberly, but the eight. I don't know. Uh uh. Seven and a half. I can go seven, seven quarter, seven and a half. Meaning you have similar wrists, but n no on the eight. And then I had another request to show the bamboo one more time. So let me grab a bamboo, please. And she's like, I, don't tell me no. I'm buying it anyway. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> no. Those earrings with the bamboo. I'm kidding. Oh, the bamboo earrings? Oh. Yeah, we just wanted a, a little... Uh, I know, I wish I could try them on for you because, like, but, yeah, I couldn't get my, I'm not that, like, limber to go underneath here, like, <laughs> but, yeah, look at that, but, you know what I think I would have done now, maybe, it's like, oh, I want to do this, I want to, maybe I would have done thicker rings, which would have made them way too heavy, so, like, these are just perfect, this punch. And then here's another really good example of your bamboo work oh yeah no this would be okay where's the ring <laughs> who's who Who's somebody whoever is this like you would have to be my set okay because you'd be my my wrist size my finger size in the eight and this i mean i feel like putting your little tanzanite you know i'm like then even dressing it up more anyway i'm working on more of the bamboo stuff but it's I know you think, oh, ha, ha. she just pulled me a tanzanite tray. I'm actually on. That's what we're doing next is tanzanite, but that's so funny. Okay, so there's three pieces of tanzanite left. Yep, and this is ring 4448. And gorgeous tanzanite. Wow. Size 8. Um, then the tanzanite set... That is ring four 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 six and pendant four 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 five. These are brilliant cuts. So do you see where you get dark colors and then like because it's it's a brilliant facet. That's what they do to a diamond. I like more facets in it, but you'll see lighter colors to darker when you move it. So if I don't do a brilliant cut, I can do a darker color. Um, but to me, a brilliant cut, I want, I, I love a brilliant cut in a round. I, I, I just have to. So, okay, next one is going to be our horse. And it is our beautiful Labradorite, okay? Look at the, look at him. This is bracelet 2580. It's a seven and a quarter, so it'll fit anywhere from a six to an eight inch wrist. Yeah, and see ones like this, I've always kind of worn. You can wear these loose or you can do it more fitted. So like, does it say it would fit me, a six? A six to an eight. Yeah, see, because see a six would, see it's not coming off and love it, yeah. Ooh, and this matches my outfit. It Look sure does. That, my camo. <laughs> okay oh we okay you know I was totally like when I first did that I think I launched this one f first no no the, uh, now I can't remember okay here is my series set but it's the only one I did with the high polish though with the flat jaw one 
And this is my Euro Shank ring. Love this. And this ring trio is number 4291. Look at, Look at the quality of that. When you get pink and greens in that Tahitian Mother of Pearl. Okay, that's money right there. This gives me that bamboo feel too. I think it'd be pretty with the bamboo, but yeah. Wow, that's really pretty. I would have kept this set. It's <laughs> very you, you do, Because the other one is like thicker, but mm -hmm. I, I love I that's love a long winner. pair. I love a long pair. Uh oh. This is the ring my mother in law wanted. Or it's I always call her my mother in law, but she's not my she's my sister's mother in law. Um, I did not know we had this left. I should have pulled it for her. This is a uh, ring trio three eight eight two. Oh my gosh. It's it, this is so this, do you know that this is not very common to actually have this? I love that. It looks like animal print with the black and white that's in it. So Gosh, that's cool. But it's a stack ring system. Okay, so if you're going to do the whole thing together, that means you need to be a seven, okay? See, because this is an eight and I put it on my seven. So this would run one size small, or what you do is you wear it normal as your eight, right? And then these, you could stack up together as your seven, like this. So that's what, like to me, I kind of love this. It's contemporary and then now you've got, cause you know how I always wear a big statement ring and this together, I would probably wear it like that. Then you could still be your eight. But if you wanted to wear it full, you, you, yeah, you, you always have to size up. So you, it's seven to an eight. Such a pretty green opal. But, yeah, no wonder she wanted it. Coordinating She's necklace. got super good taste. Yeah, good like, taste. I'm like, no wonder she wanted that one. Like, this I'm one like, also matches your outfit today. This oh, is necklace 3880. Gorgeous. I, I just, like, with these really hard to cut, like, I have to use my really, really good lapidaries. Um, yeah, they have to have mad skills for cutting um, to do the pink and the green opal. So full uh, full necklace, okay? You've got the beautiful watermark ovals. I love this elongated marquee. You know I'm doing a lot of it again. It's just the hardest cut, you lose the most material. So to me, it it is one of the most expensive cuts that you can get out there in a shape. So I, I love doing that for you ladies because you're worth any, any, like you're worth, you're worth the, the money, the effort, the status of cutting murkies. So, okay, this is so cute. You know, I love my little uh, charm dangle bracelets like this. This is bracelet four nine seven five. It is a Oops. seven and three quarters, so it yeah. is adjustable. It will fit five okay. and a half to seven and three quarters interest. So cute, and this is uh, like you know, is when you start to stack. Like, love that. I always wear that one kind of there and then I'll take a bracelet and kind of stack it behind. Put it right there so that way it just stays there like that. Look at that. So nice together. Love that. And that is bangle 6750 for all those. Oh, sorry, kids. yes. We'll get there eventually. That's that's down the road, you know, quit taking stuff off the tray. But um, I do, you know, always double side my things just in case. But yeah, fabulous, fabulous bracelet. Okay, I cannot, ladies, I have to tell you, this material you cannot get anymore. I can't even believe we have this left. Any of you ladies that love olive green, um, guess I'm gonna tell you, in two, is it gonna be Friday? Next week, I'm gonna try, I am doing an olive green, okay, my um, olive quartz ring. You need these. These like I can't even get this serpentine material anymore. It's so pretty. And do you see that? That's transparent over opaque. This was just like one of those really rare little pieces that I did. But look how pretty the the setting is on it. I yeah. love this. Uh, Lotus bracelet number is four nine seven five. The set that Janelle has on right now, the Serpentine, right we've got ring 4764 and pendant 4765. Trust me, this material is, it's fabulous. And I wish I could still do it. 
I've done serpentine from all over the, you know, like many, many different um, countries. This is the prettiest I've ever been able to do and never been able to repeat it since. So this, like, this has been in my safe. Do you know how old this is? 25 years old. Really and I've tried to re like replace it, so I'm like, I'm not cutting any, but yeah, so kind of really cool. Okay, the Mexican turquoise, the 12 by 16 um, sizes. We've got two that's, sizes, a size six a and a seven. This is ring four, three, A six and a seven in the yeah. ring? Oh, this is a seven. I know, it's surprising. We don't oh, really have right here. and seven. So this is your opportunity if that's your size. Oh. And then we also have the coordinating earrings to go with that. Okay. And that is earring 4303. And again, that was ring 4302. Okay. Yeah. Not coming that big anymore. Okay, so let's do the Tree of Life earrings. Oh my gosh. Now these do have some weight to them. Yes, because they're double-sided. Do you see, like, it's two full filigree, like, wires that we put together. And then, see, we, we marry them together to get that really cool shape. This is earring 6751. Okay. Yeah. These are cool. But, yeah, definitely a little bit of weight. I would wear the Sardabacks with those, probably. Okay, on to a new one. How's every? It's so funny. Everybody is so quiet during the vault shows because they literally are shopping because they're limited items. We've got a couple of requests here. I have to go back to at the end. All right. This is earring uh, the Star of Hope collection two three four nine. Wait a minute, I feel like, okay, so I have these. This is that same star that I did in my New Beginnings kind of collection. These are gorgeous studs. I would like, I think I said that before. I think these look like Beth. <laughs> like Beth is probably like kicking herself that she didn't get those before we started. Okay, more bamboo, but with the basket weave. These are the special possessions earrings, earring 3668. Okay, and there's none of the other bamboo stuff, which is great because I'm definitely put that on reorder already. The other basket weave, because everybody keeps asking for the bamboo and basket weave. So I actually have those coming. What do you got there? I just thought I'd be a little disruptive. Be disruptive. I thought this might give them a little something fun oh. to see real quick for next week. A little surprise sneak peek, ladies. Okay, so this is not part of the vault show. This is the this. lapis that I was saying that this bracelet that I did, like, is really, really fabulous in the carved out. Look at the lapis color in this. Are you kidding? And this is the one that I've, see how this just layers? I love it. Love it. So these are going to be next week coming Okay, in. so, yep, I've got to show that again. So... Ladies, you'll have that gorgeous lapis bracelet that goes, if you bought the ring or the pendant from me already, or the earrings, finally the bracelet came. Look at that. Gorgeous. Okay, and is this a little Hayward Muse? So, yes, we have the gorgeous middle piece, the black spinels that go to the ring. And, you know, I did the purple abalone that I, look at how pretty that is together, right? Love it, love it, because it's that burgundy-ish. So those sets go together. And you're getting that beautiful little toggle. So again, it's going to fit a lot of people. Look at that. Yeah, and just like with all sneak peek ladies, we don't have any info on this other than it's going to be here next week. Yep, we just checked them in and lined them up. But I said, Michelle, you probably just better release those to, to everybody like when you're ready. So we will let you know. Thank you, Michelle. You're excited about that stuff. Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, back to the vault because, um, oh, this, oh my gosh, this bracelet, I was like, oh my gosh. Oh, can I do it in gemstone, this and that? I'm like, it's not going to work. Like, it only works the way that this piece is perfectly put together. Um, so, 
This is these, the U-Mac These are more set. common, but this bracelet, ladies, it is, it is so cool. Like, I would not overlook that bracelet because I love the little, see the middle pieces? But yeah, it was so funny. I was like, I need to be able to, um, I need this bracelet. But then I'm like, no, I need the silver pieces. I remember how long it took me to design this. But I was like, and it was one of those ones that just didn't translate into a gemstone bracelet good. It was just that perfect, like, piece. Perfect as it is. Look at that. This is bracelet 5276, fitting from a 5.5 to an 8 inch wrist. See, I love my old silvery. Like, I'll keep trying to design because it's stuff that, like, I wear a ton of, you know? My solid silver. And I don't want ordinary silver. I don't like the quality of ordinary, like, you know... I, I wanted something a little bit more elevated. So I had to design it myself. And then we've got coordinating pendant 5277 and coordinating earring 5279. Okay. And then the little earrings. Okay. So on to some more, oh, so basically this, you know how I did the Celtic uh, pendant? These are, this will go with a lot of the, that, this was a series that I did with the bamboo and kind of almost like Celtic at the same time because people were asking me for Celtic. So this is kind of a series that I did in bamboo, but still kind of doing Celtic knots. These are the Protector of Faith Earring 4255. Look at, look at the, those are all really interwoven, okay? So most people just have the front design. They don't show where it's interwoven like that. So pr pretty, yeah, and pretty, pretty amazing skill set. Pendant is 4256. I love that veil. Look at the bamboo mm -hmm. all in a row. This That's is, a this is a pretty set. Like, this is like, mm. The kind of quality I like to do. Okay, this went to a part of a series of blue topaz that I did. So this, um, yeah, my friend Kristen was like, <sighs> it was the first thing that she's like, send me a ring, Janelle. We sold out of it, so I did. I ended up, so we didn't have the ring to sell you guys because I had sent it to her when she debuted it. That so. was earring 3008. Okay, here we go. Okay, another one of those really like the design, see where it's latching right there? See where it comes open like this? So you have a hinge, you have a retention, and that's how you get that bracelet on. So super easy to put on. Um, just beautiful, just a beautiful, elegant, gorgeous piece. Look at that. This is the old is gone and new is here bracelet. It's bracelet 5863. It's an oval seven inch fitting from a six to a seven inch wrist. See the beautiful butterflies? Yep, and the, the fringe of panties, the gorgeous leaves and the feather or leaf, whatever you want. And I love the high polish with this too. Just a really pretty piece. Yeah, this is one where I like it a little bit looser, you know, with this. And I've, I've worn it with, like, other bangles. But, yeah, something just really unusual and different. Very, very pretty, though. So, now we're going to go into the cross. And it looks like I only have the earrings that are left to this. Yep, this is earring 5759. Look at that. And see, these are all little uh, jawbone beads that are put on. But this was my, like, adaption of coin style jewelry. Because I, I really like coin style jewelry. Oh, yeah. Okay, now, this is going to be a four-piece set that we still have left in the all silver. This is the Let Him Transform You set. We've got bracelet 5748. It's a six and a half fitting from a five and a half to a six and a half inch wrist. Oh, this is the one I love because it was this, it's the six and a half. Yeah, this one, this one, this was one of the first six and a halves that I did that I was like, okay, we need more in this six and a half. 
Okay, the ring. Ring 5750. True size 8. I could wear it on my 7, but yeah, more for my 8. True to size. I could do either though. Like when I do galleries all the way to the side like this, if you're in between sizes, you, you can go back and forth with some of these bigger ones. Um, the earrings. Earring 5751. See all the different layers. And then the cute little pendant, of course. And pendant 5749. Okay. Is that it? <gasps> we only have three trays left. Did you find your favorite item yet? Oh my gosh. Okay, here's another one. I'm going to tell you there's a three piece set here, ladies. This is another one that I get super excited about the bracelet. Because, yeah, these are those like four digit bracelets that I keep telling you. Like, these are the ones I love to design. And when you put these on, you just feel that luxury. Look at this. This is the Grace Bracelet, bracelet 2743. It uh, is adjustable from a six to a seven and three quarters inch wrist. Wow, that's really pretty. Okay, so yeah, something's just really beautiful and quilted. Yeah, I kind of went through a little quilted series, but always liking the scallop, you know? Matching pendant number 2744. And I love that these are like full, um, they go up on your ear a little bit more. I mean, right there, this, I mean, the, even just this kind of look, this with the, the bracelet, wow. That is earring 2746. Yeah, very pretty. It's a good set. Yes, this, um, will you more uh, highlight this uh, bracelet for me? Because mm -hmm. I gotta be honest, the style of this is phenomenal. Um, I don't, like, it's hard to nail a bracelet like that, so I'm like, oh, okay, I gotta think what I'm doing. Okay, oh my gosh, we have the peace sign? Okay, somebody was asking me about earrings. You gotta let them know about that, because literally, that's, I got the piece, they asked me for earrings, so this would be the, the moment. This is earring 4252. And then we've also got the uh, Reassurance of Peace bracelet. That's bracelet 4249. It's a six and a half, and it's adjustable from six mm -hmm. to seven and a half inches. That's right. And this is one that we have on our website right now, but guess what? This is the original sample, which I like, because this is the, the original of the original, which I, I kind of love that. And this is pendant 4250. Look at, with the bird and the, yeah. This was pretty cool. Okay, oh my gosh, we've got the hoop. Oh no, I think we sold out one of the pairs. We've got three sizes left. Oh my gosh. Okay, so let's look at the sizes on these first. So the smallest let's, is a 25 millimeter. Okay, let's go with that. So that is one inch, I'd say. One inch hoops. And that's earring 5310. And then we've got the 30 millimeter, which is earring 5309. Inch and a quarter. And then we've got the 45 millimeter earring Ooh. 4252. Inch and three quarters. Now this is your, these are your full hammered hoops, okay? With your uh, retention, okay? So that's what we've got on those. So, yep. Yeah. Ever. Somebody asked, you know, and I'm like, well, would I do that base, you know, the basic hammered? Yes, you know, we want them. So we did them. Okay. Oh, this is the three piece set also. So this is when I was designing and I ended up going with my Janelle Adair, but this is when I was starting to do stuff for my diamond line. Okay. So this was the original bracelet and earring when I was, I was, starting to design some stuff for the diamonds. So that's how this silver one kind of came to life. This is the Reflection in a Mirror set. 
And we've got uh, two sizes in bracelet, four, seven, three, five. We've got an oval six and three quarters, fitting from a six to a six and three quarter, and an oval seven and a half, fitting from a six and a half to a seven and three quarter. And then we've got matching earring, four, seven, three, seven, and matching ring, four, seven, three, six. Yeah. Yeah, it was just that really, really high, high-end quality that I did on this series but something very low profile, you know? I was just gonna do little diamond accents before, so I kind of started to prep, and then I went another direct. I love this so much in silver that I just kept it silver, and then I redid some designs for the diamonds. But yeah, I love how easy, you see it's magnet retention, so it's super easy to get on and off. Yeah, I love, very elevated, I mean, just a real, again, like the one that I finally went, Ooh, Super sophisticated. <gasps> Can you believe we have these earrings left? Okay, ladies, these are the zero mercury earrings. Everybody has that ring and everybody has that pendant. We had that on Black Friday. Oh my gosh, you gotta grab these. This is earring 5488. Oh, I'm also surprised we still have those. Oh my gosh, these are the one of a kind. And these are, like, I don't, I can't get better. I can, matter of fact, I can't even cut the big, the quartz anymore. I cannot get them that, that size for the, the quality. So cool, oh my gosh, that we have those left. Oh, we sold everything, but we still have the earrings in the, uh, to me, this, this, this opal collection I did reminded me of the cotton candy. Do you see the different layers of the colors and stuff? Yeah, I love these little pink opal earrings. These were so cool, but see, see all the different layering of the colors? That's why a drop is really hard. Earring 5288. See the banding on both of them? Yeah, these were really hard to match, but the banding is what I would went. This collection was only about the banding. Oh, what? I Ashley, Ashley. Oh my gosh, if Ashley is watching, this is your set, my girl. That's um, black we, we are trying to get the, oh, it's because the ring lights kept showing in it last time. Oh, there, you got a really good one. Okay, so do you see the turmoil? I don't even think, and there's a rainbow that runs through this. I will never, like I said, Jess, she said, we can't get that quality now. I said, but let's try, it's let's so try. Uh, this is the Brazilian tourmalated quartz, and you are never going to find this quality again. But Ashley, this is like, cause she gets those higher end pieces like that for me. Like she's got that quality eye, like, and she likes the bigger kind of like, yeah, I love this. This is ring five, four, four, zero and pendant five, four, three, nine. So you see that you, it's actually like, well, yeah, this is amazing. But he's never gonna be able to do that. But I'm like, let's try again, let's try. It's like, you know, he's never going to be able to do that. I'm, I'm going to, I'm still going to try. Okay. So my Amazonite, one of my best selling Amazonite rings I ever designed. Like, I love this one. This is ring it's five, so good. four, four, three. It's so pretty. True size eight on that. Mm -hmm. I, I feel like everybody, like, what stone do I need? Like, and it's, it's so specific too. Yeah, the Amazonite was the perfect, perfect. Oh, we got a, P, a pair of the London Blue Topaz earrings. This with is the Swiss earring. Blue Topaz earrings. Five, four, four, eight. This was that really cool little bezel that we created. Was there a question? Mickey, well, uh, do we have someone a question? has uh, decided to thank me for a question I answered and it's still on the feed. Now, as much as I appreciate compliments to me, I think uh, our uh, viewers would probably pr uh, appreciate it not being there. What? There's a comment showing up for some reason on our YouTube. Yes, I'll carry this. Okay. And it's not live. There we go. Okay. But please send compliments to me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm right, totally perfect. lost. I don't even know what that means. What is that? <laughs> we had a comment up that didn't need to be. Um, this is Braceated Jasper. We've got a locket and a ring. <gasps> The uh, locket is number 5795, and the ring Look is number... Look at the quartz with the brie-shaded uh, jasper. Like, that is such a one-of-a-kind, beautiful, beautiful ring. Oh, my gosh. 
And then we I feel like I didn't show this one. Oh my gosh, how is this still here? Did I not show this one? Ring I feel like I might have done the pendant, but oh my gosh, that is so good. So do you see the burgundy and then all the, yeah, I love appreciated mood cut. But can I tell you, this is one of the most, uh, one of the biggest, but probably most gram weight lockets I've ever done because of the chain link. Look at this. Crazy. That that is a that feels like that's a like one of those ounces of silver. I'm like, this has gotta be, oh my gosh, if you have a guy that like really like this would be such an amazing gift for a gent. Oh my gosh, he would love this. One of your fashion forward guys. Okay, roses. We love the roses. This is a powder pink mother of pearl. Oh my gosh. This is a pendant 5817. Rose, rose and rose. You have your trio of roses. Look at that. Beautiful. So pretty. Okay, so. I have two, I have one pink vapor with that really beautiful cross. I have the really big, big cross um, on our website like this. Man, that'd be pretty layered, like wear this up really high and then wear a second chain to layer with, and the other cross is probably about this size, probably like layering it. And then look at the earrings, then doing the earrings. Sometimes it's appropriate to add additional things, right, on. This is pendant 5821. That is a pink vapor. And then we've got earring 5823. The perfect little frangipane so crosses. Mm. <gasps> Surprises is left. Oh my gosh, you know why? Because remember, somebody had like put oh, it. Oh, we thought it was. So I thought it was the wrong not size. size. So this is actually, I was like, no, this is a fun. This really is a size eight. So this is correct, and look at this. Look at the, sh the, the cutting and the shape of that. Like, look at that, oh my gosh. Custom, custom, custom. You could pay, like these are the kind of stones they enter in at like the, the you know, JCK show that you go to. Thousand dollars for an amethyst because of this. Like this is what these go for. So it's, it's kind of exciting. And it really is a size eight. <laughs> it really is. Remember, it was like, oh my gosh. So anyway, it's an eight, but remember, you get adjustability with that. So you can make it smaller. You can make it, you know, a little bit bigger with the gap. So yeah, I'd say seven, eight, nine. This will work. And that's ring five. Or eight, actually, eight, I five. thought it was a five. So maybe a six, seven, eight yeah. probably would be because literally it, it can like when you do this, you could curve it on the inside too. Okay. So two pieces of the mosaic turquoise. This is the Kingman turquoise. Um, now this is big. So I, I'm kind of going to give a measure on that one. Pendant 5844. And again, a marquee, which is like, yeah, always for a level of dif difficulty, marquees are the, the toughest. And the mosaic. But I love all the different colors of the turquoise. That's why I love it. Wear it with your Mexican turquoise. Wear it with your Campito's turquoise. Wear it with Sleeping Beauty turquoise. You've got all the colors. Wear so it with pretty. your Amazonite. <gasps> I know. Turquoise and Amazonite. So good. But yeah, I love all the multis. That was what I went for on this when I said I want minimum three to five shades of turquoise colors in the mosaic. Oh, let me give that one a measure too. So you can see it's a... Uh, smaller, but that is going to measure about right there. And this is earring 5846. Okay. Oh, this is the Xanadu. Oh my gosh, this is actually going to go with the stuff that we actually. You know what? This can look very close to. Um, we had some Xanadu cut like this, but um, Dragon Wings too oh, yeah. would be pretty with it too. But Xanadu, we love Xanadu. And this is the raspberry rhodolites. Look at the rhodolite. Oh my gosh, that's when they were like grape color. Wow. This is ring 5966 and pendant 5967. Wow. Look at that. 
Yes. See, that's what I do on the fancies is we really, we, we do the top of the crown of the stone. That's pr uh, produces a bunch more colors. You got like that berry, that wine color, that mm. orange flash, that blue flash. Wow, this is such a pretty set. Wow. It's electric. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Okay, uh, red velvet zircon. Okay, that's amazing. Um, red velvet, I, it makes me want a cupcake. We've got pendant 5992 and Ooh. earring 5994. Ladies, look at the color that I did the sample in. Oh my gosh, are you kidding? Wow. This is really pretty. Oh my gosh, this could be your, like, you could even do this, like, your, your, uh, for Palm Sunday, like going to church, because you know, the way that I did it, it can kind of represent the Maltese cross too. Be beautiful. So pretty. Look at the galleries on these two. Gorgeous. Okay. Ladies, we are on our last tray. So that means we have one, two, three, four, five. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve pieces left. Five sets. So um, I'm gonna do the tans tonight first because it's a three-piece collection. Okay. So we've got the little tans tonight locket. And that is and, pendant six one seven one. And then the little J hoops, so cute, right? And the chain link. Earring 6173. Those are big tanzanites. Those tanzanites are bigger than the, the, the pendant tanzanite. And then we've got the matching oh. ring as well. And that is ring 6172. You know what? I missed that. I didn't show this last time. Oh my gosh, seriously? Oh, I love these two ring sets because like they're, yeah, you can split them apart. I love that. So cute. This reminds me of Ray Lum. <laughs> but you know what? She's so tiny. She probably is not an eight. She probably needs like a six. Okay. Um, okay. So we also have a Rose de France with the amethyst. Or no, this is the talkative topaz. Yep. We've got a uh, Rose de France and amethyst and uh, talkative mystic topaz. And this is pendant 6209. See, so you see, again, it's a fancy cut. You see where it's just like glistening and sparkling like from the inside out. And I love this because this has the magnet enhancer, kind of the hidden in magnet enhancer. Gorgeous. Uh, this is like that really small size too. Like, you know, because I tend to do like two inch pendants. So this is definitely me like... Toning it in a bit. Making some smaller. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, Janelle, could you design some smaller? Oh, I can do it. <laughs> that was my effort at trying. Okay, so here we go in the stark faceted. Um, gorgeous. I love this cluster, but I want you to see how we build the watermark and up to match the bezel. It, it's just it's just quality, quality, quality. Beautiful piece. That has a lot of work. See all individual pieces. Like, wow. That's beautiful. Mm -hmm. White quartz in this, both uh, the pendant and the uh, earrings. And this is pendant 6218 and earring 6220. Okay. Let's bring all this in. This is the Algerin Opal. Okay. Um, this is with the quartz when I window box them. So I wanted to do a really nice size stud on, on the point, okay? Earring at 6275. Beautiful. And then the pendant and the ring. Pendant 6273 and ring 6274. 
Mm -hmm. I think that's going to fit like a glove. Watch this. Yes. Beautiful. Both of those are pricey. Ooh, I feel like I want to put my nails back to that color again. Oh, that pink. Ooh, but it's pretty, yeah. We've got these at $79.99 today, so it's a good deal. Ooh, wow. Okay. Um, ooh, the champagne pearl. We got two pieces left. Oh my gosh. Okay. So, uh, such, such a pretty, pretty, pretty color. I've got earring 6286 and pendant 6284. This is a good little size too. I love the color of the champagne pearl. Mm. We have people snatching up some things. Gwen Clemens grabbed the blue topaz <gasps> earrings. Audrey Moore grabbed the red zircon pendant. Oh, she did. Oh my gosh, she's going to wear it to church. She is, I bet you. So the zircon, was that gorgeous or what, right? I know the red velvet. I like it so, it makes me so happy that in my 30 years that I got. I found something like that. I'll, I'll talk about that the rest of my life. Like, <gasps> that I got it. That I got it. Oh my gosh. Remember when I found... Yeah, Janelle. We remember when you found the red velvet at Zircon. Yes, in Tucson. We do. And when you found the Canyon Ruby too, Janelle. We remember that too. Like, every year there's one that like, yeah. It's that just... special stone. Okay, this is the exclusive stone to us. And it's topaz. This is a very big topaz and um, in a fancy cut. So this is the Royal Bali Blue Topaz. And it's, of course, in a size eight, and I love this style. Ring 6760. Yeah, fabulous. Look at that. Topaz, facets, so beautiful. But look at the, you're getting, oh my gosh. That is so weird. Like, I just saw that flash red, but do you see where you move it and you're getting the deep, dark, like, blues to that, the lighter, like, just that, that beautiful blue. Okay, very pretty. I love that. I love my yes. real bubbly blue. Is it? Let's check in with Mickey to see if we've got any requests. Oh, let's see. Yes. Do we have any, any questions, anything that's going on? How have you seen the feed? I don't even see anything. Oh, there it is right there. Yeah, sometimes I really oh, it's so them. weird how it's... Uh, Amberly just said LOL last item and it's sold out. Yeah, that uh, okay. last ring was sold out. Oh, it was? Uh, okay, yeah. of course. Ruby, Janelle, your details on the piece pendant is incredible. She says, oh my gosh, reflections in a mirror, Leanne says. We're at the end. We'll see you all tomorrow. Barbara Behar, yes, we will see you tomorrow. Yes, and we did have a request to show a couple of items from Ray, who does a, such a fabulous job over Oh my gosh, the, yes. Uh, oh, did I? Valley Dave's page. Uh, she gave us the item list, so we got a couple of them up here real quick. So we can oh, show okay. Them oh, she wants to see, yeah, she wants see the volcanic quartz. Volcanic? I didn't the, show any volcanic. Oh, the volcanic quartz bracelet. Yes, oh my gosh. I was like, when you said volcanic, um, this is volcanic lava rock, um, but volcanic quartz. I was thinking that that we have this electric like pink with the blue flash. Oh, okay. So I was like, but that's this, that's something I'm working on right now because I've got some pieces. So here's that bracelet. And did you see how that goes together? You push down. See that little guy right there. So you push him with your finger. That's how you open it. But see how you can see where it's not done. To lock him in, you have to press him down again and see, that's how you lock him. Like, so cool. That's my double safety. You know how I try to put a double safety on everything? And that's why I made him lower profile like that. And she wants to see it next to the lower And see, these were knotted too, which is pretty incredible. These are all like knotted. Really cool. And is there, uh, we have a question. Oh, you found it, okay, so I'll let you. Uh... Oh, she's still looking for it. Yeah. Um, you know what? Maybe that's what they did because there is a little stretch. Remember, they, they said six to a, six and a half, like so. Yeah, because these are strung really tight and then they're looser. What else are we looking for? I am looking for the uh, other mother pearl ring. 
Oh, the pear shape one. Yeah, she wanted to see that with the uh, volcanic, but I just. Oh, I that right here. Oh, oh she's not just gonna walk over and pick it out right away. <laughs> I know, I design everything, even yeah. like with my, limited, know, right? well, my limited eyesight right now. Do, I know, I love like, and then the just girls, for but reference, how do you know all that? I'll bring that other ring in there so you can kind of see those. Okay, two. so, oh, the volcanic bracelet. There we go, right thank there. you. Oh, you're thinking this with this? Ooh, very like tribal, cool. Well, it doesn't look that way, but you know, because it's hand and Bali, mm -hmm. then you've got the Tahitian on the island of Tahiti and Oh my gosh, you've now gone global. Like, I love it. Yes, I love those together. Oh, so she's trying to decide between this one or this one. I don't know. Like, I got to tell you, I get this in the abalone one, maybe. This one is yeah. kind of different with that stack. I don't know. If you're thinking, I maybe do this one, but get this in the new abalone we're doing it in. This one is like, I don't know. Wow, they're fabulous. But, um, yeah, and because we have the high polish, you can wear these separately, right? So, if you're going to pick one, I think you get three pieces there. And I'm doing this in the abalone, and the abalone is fabulous. But the Tahitian shell, just so you know, I'm not getting the colors in the Tahitian shells anymore. It's mainly just brown by the time they carve into them. So, like the colors, I... I'm not getting, and I can't even ask for the colors anymore if I do carved. Like they, a lot of times they're just brown with the white, you know. So you're not gonna go wrong with either of them, okay? Okay, what else? Uh, I just have a question. Yeah, uh, you, you may have mentioned this while I was uh, running around doing a couple of things. Uh, no inlay, uh, Aisha Malik wants to know, if no inlay means no reorder on the black and white mosaic. Oh, the, oh, okay, so like we're trying the inlay with the animals. Yeah. So I can't do any of the animals, no. Okay. Now the stones, the mosaic, like I do the elephant, I can do the stones somewhere else, but us doing inlay, like the bees, you know mm -hmm. how they want the bees? Yeah. Uh-uh. Okay. The, those I do in Bali, mm -hmm. we can't. Um, the quality be, would be really different. Like what, who I manufactured for other people, but the quality I did, those p guys are not. Mm -mm. But cool. I manufacture for a lot of people, so it's inexpensive in lane, but mm -hmm. I'm not sure if my ladies would like that. Gotcha. <laughs> the quality, because, and I don't put Sarda on it at all. So, yes. Okay. Nobody knows that I make it. That cool. is it. I think that is it. Okay. Well, ladies, tomorrow, is the big show. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I better make sure I wash my hair tomorrow. <laughs> Put my lashes on uh, for you. Okay. Well, anyway, what? how fun. I can't wait. Um, now, I know the ladies are putting pictures together of some requests, so I can't wait to see what people do want to see. But here's the thing. The things that did sell out would be the ones we would reorder because it's 1-1. If it didn't and it sat there, I will not bring it back because it just doesn't make sense, right? If there's mm -hmm. one in it, it doesn't yeah. go. Yeah. So it would be things we would be selecting them from the items we don't have. Right. right. Makes sense. But um, definitely, I mean, this is an opportunity to bring some things back for sure, but really let people fill in their, their collections uh, with what they needed to. Cool. Right. I guess we'll see everybody okay, tomorrow. Okay, we'll see everybody tomorrow. Take care. Bless